So what's good, TMG fam? It's your boy L, and I'm back with another reaction. How y'all feel? Welcome back to the channel. Salute. Listen, you know what I was just thinking about, bro? It's that time of the year. Have the little fire pits outside if you're able to. You know what I mean? Have that nice, cool air, atmosphere, vibe. And to watch some scary videos, man. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm, oof, it's that time of the year, bro. Some of y'all know what I'm talking about. Some of y'all might be watching this video doing that very thing right now. I'm jealous. Super jealous, y'all. If y'all, if y'all really doing that, I'm jealous. Super jealous. So we're going to get into the top 10 scary videos that'll make you scream hysterically. Y'all ready for that? Can we do that? Can we get into that? Can we do that? Let's do that. All right. So if you're new to the channel, man, hit the subscribe button. Join the fam real quick. Moment of silence for the haters. That's enough. Now run the likes up. Make sure y'all hit that like button. Here we go. Some videos make you laugh, others make you cry, but the videos on this list are for something else altogether. These are the top 10 scary videos that'll make you scream hysterically. Number 10. Run and get help. Security cameras are supposed to make you feel more secure, not less. Erk522 is posting this home security footage to the ghost subreddit on behalf of a co-worker, noting that you can hear a voice in the footage. He writes, I understand a hacker wanting to be creepy and watch people's cameras, but why whisper some nonsense? What nonsense is he talking about? At the very beginning of the clip, as the dog is rising from the couch, you can hear a voice whisper. Run. Help. Some of the comments think it's a dog making that noise, but it just doesn't sound like a dog noise at all. Others say it sounds demonic. What kind of dog you got that make that kind of noise? Demonic. The Redditor notes that others Your dog possessed he making that kind of noise. Strange things have happened in the home since she moved in, and he suggested to burn some sage in the house. Most though believe someone might have hacked the camera and is using this vulnerability to scare the homeowner. Do you feel secure? I don't anymore. Caught me Number on nine, Caught me. Grudge Girl again. You can run, but you can't hide from a grudge girl. This time she appears in an abandoned home in Pakistan. Published in June of 2021, this explorer is taking video of a concrete staircase that leads up to darkness. Behind it, darkness. All around it, darkness. He moves to the side of the stairwell and that's when she appears. Allahu Akbar, la ilaha illallah. Allahu Akbar, Allahu Akbar. Seemingly floating, the girl in a white dress with dark hair hanging before her face hovers there in the darkness beyond. The cameraman cries out, and in seconds, a creepy grudge girl does something we've never seen her do before. She floats upward and then vanishes altogether. Even creepier, she appears to disappear directly into the ceiling above her. Does now, some of y'all are like me, and y'all looking for the hole. I'm looking for the hole up there to see if somebody was up there pulling it through a hole. But I don't see it. it looks like it's just straight concrete, no opening. And then I'm thinking, okay, maybe it could have been like somebody holding it down from the window. But if they did that, it would have kind of caught the the roof right there as you're trying to pull it up or it would have swung. The way she pulled up, I don't like it. <laughs> I tell you, I'm look I'm trying to shoot holes in it, but I can't really see. I don't know. That one, that one there is. That, 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 that's a good one. That's a good one right there. I'm trying to poke holes in it, but that's a good one. Grudge Girl have a new magic trick? Don't be deceived. This is not magic. It's the real deal. Allahu Akbar! Allahu Akbar! Ah! Number 8. Mysterious Fishman. Aquaman may be real, or so this video would have you believe. Posted by TikToker Nikki X Insta under the headline. 
things caught on camera that shouldn't have. You'll see exactly why this is true. A little boy peers into an enormous underground aquarium. He seems to see something beyond the glass that we can't. As he points at the glass, his dad turns to the descriptive plaque to see what this aquarium is supposed to hold. He notes it doesn't say, but as he's turned away, an ear-piercing scream is heard. Turning back, he captures his son connecting with a horrifying Aquaman type creature. The son ain't seem scared at all. Beyond See, kids have no fear, bro. He was just right there, like, my friend. He just had his hand up. The glass with an enormous webbed hand and an elongated extraterrestrial looking cranium. The grayish creature's eyes glow as it blinks at its audience and towards the camera. Is he friend or foe? Do you really want to know? Number seven, say cheese. There are plenty of ghosts out trick-or-treating on Halloween night, but some of them aren't wearing sheets. Originally posted on TikTok, this clip shows a woman adjusting Halloween decorations, only to be met with a real-life haunting. Skulls are placed on gate posts surrounding a property, and the woman is captured on camera turning one of the creepy skulls, which has twisted in the opposite direction. After readjusting it to face the pathway like all the other skulls, she walks away, but the skull isn't interested in staying put. Moments after she leaves, it turns with a wide grin to the camera. Say cheese. Better yet, trick or treat. <laughs> Number See, that's why you don't put skulls out right there. <laughs> that's why you don't play with skulls right there. Number six, into the woods. Are you afraid of the woods? This scary video confirms that you have every right to be. Posted by Bug Boho in May of 2021, this clip has been trending in the Spanish-speaking YouTube community, although the original source, which is cited as a Thai YouTuber called Cops to Wear, could not be found. The Thai urban explorer searches out the truth of myths and legends. In the scary video, he enters a Thai jungle in search of a mysterious creature that's said to be stalking livestock. Villagers claim the creepy creature is born from the depths below itself. Upon entering the dark jungle, the explorer starts to hear frightening noises noises, growls and moans. And as it continues, he peers through the surrounding branches and brambles to find the source. The noise sound like a walker from like Walking Dead, right? Noises grow louder, and the explorer approaches the creature we believe was myth, only to find out the monster very much isn't. <laughs> you can see its long talons first while the rest of him remains camouflaged, but a few steps closer, and the creature springs. It is out to take a life. <laughs> As the obscure figure with long hair and a dark, sullen face pounces, our intrepid- I told y'all it sounded like a walker, right? And then it looked like an old lady walker. Grandma would've got shot today. You know what I mean? Grandma would've got taken out today. Sorry, old lady. The explorer screams and retreats backward, and yet he continues trying to capture better footage of the creature as it creeps amongst the trees. <laughs> You gain a few more glimpses here and there, but nothing like the window into his soul that was caught during their encounter. Is your heart racing? Let out a scream. No one here will judge you. <laughs> Number 5. Most Haunted House in the Village 
Our paranormal journey now brings us to India, home of RKR history. On April 21st, 2021, the group released a video of what is allegedly the most haunted home in their village. After some details behind the building's history, the investigation begins. The lead goes through a door into another room but then stops and listens for a moment. At first, it almost sounds as if a woman is crying. Nigga. After some time without activity, an object on the side of the screen suddenly shifts and falls. Bucky, yeah, <clears throat> Neither man was moving at the time, nor were they near it, meaning they couldn't have knocked it over accidentally. Hmm. Furthermore, the object had remained perfectly balanced before then, and appears to have been pushed. While inspecting the fallen object, a large board suddenly falls from their right, falling hard to the ground. <laughs> Again, the camera operator wasn't moving and only did so after the board was already falling. And strange things continue to happen when a bucket mysteriously drops from behind. This time it appears to actually hit the cameraman as he visibly shudders as it falls. Soon after, a small stool appears to be thrown at the man, despite neither of them moving or possibly causing it to fall. By now, it seems whatever haunts the home doesn't like guests. As the men walk back towards the door, an audible sliding sound or possibly a hiss can be heard behind them. They are unable to see what made the sound and are both clearly startled. Nobody else is seen in the building and both men are too far away to have done it. The men stand silently in the storage room when a large metallic thing is knocked or slid off balance on the rack it is hanging from. Moments later, it is knocked again, appearing to be pushed with some force. Officially frightened, they decide to end the investigation. Something does seem to be resting within the home long after its demise, but what or who is it, and why did it come off so aggressive? Number 4. Ghost in Attic Just when you think you're alone in the world, the afterlife taps you on the shoulder. In June of 2014, YouTuber Nugget Noggin wrote, Abby and I went exploring inside of an old abandoned house. When we got upstairs, I felt like someone was watching us. Let's see what happened next. Michael is exploring the house which has been torn apart and graffitied. Me and Abby decide to take a look in the attic, but it feels like something heavy is lying on the attic door. As Michael scans the cracks of the door's outline, something appears to move. Could be somebody up Oh man, somebody's standing on it. Cause I sure can't lift it up. I wonder which way it lifts up. Lifts up this way. Is someone up there? They later capture a strange EVP that they don't seem to hear at the moment. It sounds like a deep low growl. Somebody's been in here since I've been in here. Pringles can. But yeah, this is the box we found the stuff in. But somebody's been back in here. While upstairs, Michael got the strong feeling that something was watching them from the attic. He pulled out his 16 megapixel camera to take pictures with the flash off. When he looked at the pictures at home later, he was shocked at what he saw in the attic's opening. What appears to be a ghostly child's face was captured peering out at them. Michael should have trusted his gut. It seems they weren't alone after all. Definitely check out his channel. Michael makes very interesting content. Number 3. Paranormal Activity IRL Could you handle- Man, I meant to tell y'all, man, what used to creep me out, though. It made me think I don't know what that- My grandmother, when I was young, her chimney. And she used to have birds in her chimney, but it sound like- I don't know, it just used to make a weird sound, bro. I, it used to- I, That just made me flashback. I don't know why, it just made me flashback to that moment as a kid. Her chimney used to mess me up, bro. Like, cause it only, I felt like they only did it 
when I was by myself in that living room. It only did it then. All right, my bad. I had to get that thought out. <laughs> Living with a poltergeist who makes this much clatter? That's what YouTuber Really Haunted and his family does on a daily basis. Published in June of 2021, the scary video shows the first paranormal activity of the year starting on January 5th. The first bit of activity occurs when what appears to be a hamper is pulled suddenly to the floor. The aggression of the way it's pulled is truly disturbing. The next bit occurs in the cinema room. The footstool of a reclining couch kicks out with no one sitting in it. The last bit is the scariest of them all. A book on the windowsill in the living room is thrown across the room with great force. One YouTuber, Christine Teal, points out that in slowing down the clip, two glowing eyes appear in the window for a moment just as the book is flying across the room. This finding makes the powerful poltergeist activity in this home even more frightening. Would you be able to live here? Probably not. Number 2. Scary Grudge Girl if creepy girls looking straight out of the 2004 film The Grudge still freak you out in 2021, then warning, you're about to freak the freak out. Published by Memorora, Sobernatural, INC in July of 2021, this scary video is all kinds of jump scare. While pouring over an abandoned house, this urban explorer has the creepy encounter of a lifetime. At the end of the hallway, dressed in white with long black hair draped before her face, this haunting figure stands holding a blue rag. In front of her, a large piece of furniture moves on its own. Later, as the explorer panics, he is turning into a room, hyperventilating, when a window shutter bangs closed and open again. He shines his flashlight into the outer darkness, but nothing appears to be there. He encounters the grudge girl a second time, her arms dangling stiffly and awkwardly while holding that same blue cloth. She throws it towards him as she slams the door shut. Again, as he's filming video in the same room. Why is she throwing her clothes? Does this ghost want to be freaky with him? Was that like an invitation? <laughs> was that was this, was this a freaky ghost? Was it an invitation or something? Where he first saw her, oh, the big ch oh, nasty ghost. chair moves around on its own. Oh, nasty grudge girl. Sliding backwards against the wall as he turns to leave, he captures the creepy grudge girl one last time in his purview. <laughs> She is standing uncomfortably near, her hair hanging before her face. Third time is definitely not the charm when it comes to apparitions, so the explorer takes us as his cue to take a hike. I wouldn't go back there anytime soon. I've got a challenge for you. Fire. Damn, where the fire came from? No. I'm Shadow Man at Overbrook. The Overbrook Asylum has a reputation. Known as The Bin, the abandoned asylum's actual name is Essex County Hospital of Cedar Grove. Spanning 325 acres with buildings connected by tunnels, the late 19th century hospital has more than a few stories to tell. Over 10,000 patients are believed to have lost their lives here over the course of their stay, with 150 simply vanishing into thin air during its overcrowding in the 1940s, which may be why this spirit never left. In January of 2011, a videographer who released a photography book called Antiquity Echoes, a photograph tour of abandoned America, posted her findings on YouTube under a channel of the same name. Shot in black and white, the creepy clip captures a quiet hallway inside the asylum at night. 
Off to the side, you can see an empty stretcher that likely once hauled some of the asylum's patients. But what's even more disturbing is what you can see on the far wall. A mysterious light casts against the wall at the end of the hallway. As the videographer scans towards the stretcher watching the light, a shadow figure is seen moving. It quickly walks past from left to right and then again from right to left before disappearing from sight. Antiquity Echo says this was taken with an infrared camcorder in the asylum's basement. She was alone in the hospital at the time. Or was she? Can this shadow be explained? Who does it belong to? YouTuber RM Barnes asks the question, but well, why does it come back? Responding to himself, he answers, Maybe there's no escape. The following videos are some of the most... Now, so y'all just witness a freaky ghost. And what is it about the hair being in the front that you... It does make it look creepy. I ain't even gonna lie to you, man. But what's happening? Is the head spin around in death or in, in purgatory or wherever they're coming from? What's going on? I don't know, man, but it's something wrong with my brain, man. It is... There's something wrong with my brain. I automatically see her throwing his clothes and it just, that just became funny to me. I'm sorry. <laughs> I can't help it. it. It just became funny to me. You know what I mean? So if you can't find humor in some things, man, you're living life wrong, bro. Have some humor in your life. You need it. You know what I'm saying? But y'all get at me in the comment section, man. Let me know what you think. And stick around and stay tuned. You know, I'm coming back. It's your boy L. I'm gone. Peace.